How is it going, bitches? This is FML here. <laughs> For a second, it sounded like I was trying to be like Silent Rob, but, F you know, that motherfucker doesn't play MMOs. Come on now. Uh, yeah, so, just kind of for grins. I mean, I can't say no one wanted to see this. I, I guess a couple people probably wanted to see this. But I thought I'd do some of uh, Warcath Killing on a stream for once. Uh, gonna be camping a lot more of this guy. But the thing is, like, if I'm trying to do this, like, actually on stream, well... I mean, I'm going to put some music on in a sec, because I don't want to hear Vorkath's theme song playing all, all the time when I'm doing this, for sure. But, uh... I don't even think I'm going to bother advertising this on YouTube. I mean, who really, you know, who really gives a rat's ass? Or advertising on Discord, not YouTube. So we're, we're just kind of let that go. Um, I pretty much already got the shit that I need to um, camp for at least, you know, an hour and a half. Maybe two hours at the most, you know, maybe. But, uh, real quick, let me... Go ahead and get a, uh... What do you want to call it? Uh, some music going. Um... Video game radio... Is this it? Yeah, this is it. Okay, that might actually be a little loud here. Well, first of all, let me... Let me, let me actually turn off the volume of, uh... Of everything here. That is definitely too loud. It's a, yeah, that's that's definitely too loud. Let me turn that down just a little bit. Apparently this is Final Fantasy XII Infiltration. I bet my buddy would be familiar with this song. So so my thing with Vorketh is uh, I like to have a little bit of noise for when he does certain moves. Like the actual music can be turned off, but I like to hear the noise. So there's that. So actually, let me... I probably want the uh, the sound effects on. Yeah. Unfortunately, I do not have a. Uh, I do not have my own maxed out house yet, so I pretty much have to do it this way. I have to go all the way over here. I like to use Workless. I I, I like his name, by the way, of his house. Yeah, gonna be killing a fair amount of Warcath. And I also have Loot Tracker here, too, to track my progress, naturally. Uh, I pretty much already have all, all the things that I need here. I I'm gonna be focusing, like, a, a fair amount, so if someone enters the chat, probably won't be able to hear you, or won't be able to notice you real, you know, super fast. Because I'll be in the middle of the kill most most likely, but you know, hopefully I could do something. I do have uh, what 200 kills or something. Hold on a sec. Uh, what is it again? I'm using Rune Light naturally. Yeah, 296. So about 300. Soon to be 300. As you can see, a lot of guys here are are wanting to do this. The great thing is, if I die here, it's just 100k to get my stuff stuff back. It's not it's not that big a deal. I always drink this, and I drink the other potion real quick. And let's uh, open his ass up or wake his ass up. Yeah, I've been killing this guy for uh, a fair amount of time, but it's I'm I'm literally only doing this for the money. I don't give a fuck. I mean, you know, if I do get the pet, that'd be nice. He's already hit me kind of hard here. Dude. This, this part can really fuck you up if you don't know what to do. Probably gonna have to lower the, uh... 
lower the volume of the music here a bit and turn the sound up even more. I can't even hear it through my headset. I mean, the basic, the basic idea is to get him down to, um, like 265 health and then switch my, switch to my other, uh, bolts. I do not like this acid pool either. This part sucks ass. It sounds like more Final Fantasy XII music to me. Oh shit. There we go. Although, you know, on the plus side, uh, as well as getting the money, I'm really getting the range experience too. There we go, that should be under 265, yeah. Did I mention I hate that super breath move that he, like, arcs towards you? I always hated that fucking move. That'll basically one-hit kill you if it hits you directly. Yeah, I really gotta turn up the volume here for the sound effects. The purple breath is probably the easiest thing to deal with, to be honest. Dude. Of course I gotta do more of this shit. I thought I was gonna get three three kills this trip. Looks like it's gonna be two. Sometimes you just get fucking unlucky. Like I'm doing I pretty much have the best gear you can have for this. It's just you know, it's how good you can hit an RNG pretty much. Hopefully I at least get some good loot. Well there's one kill done. I don't know why he keeps hitting me so hard right now. I mean it's not like I was poisoned or anything. I'm surprised he didn't poison me to be honest. Alright, let me... Maybe lower that a little bit here. Got a dragon longsword. That's not That's not bad. That's not bad. I usually just high alk those. I don't really bother to, to sell them on the GE. Alright. Yeah, I can hear a little bit of his sound now. That should help me. I might raise it even more, but I, I don't want it to overpower the music, you know? Shit. Some groovy music playing, goddamn. Ooh. Dude. Bitch almost killed me there. Yeah, this is exactly why I didn't want to do this um, on a stream. But like I said, it's a hundred it's a hundred K to get your stuff back, which isn't too unreasonable. Once you get really good, you know you can kill them easily 20, 20, 30 times in a row without without dying, so you know, I'm, I would say I'm about at that point. You know, sometimes his uh a couple of his moves will throw me over. Also, hey dragon. How's it going, man? Oh, ooh, 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 ooh. Get out of the way, bud. I'll look at your message here in a sec. I pretty much just saw it out of the corner of my eye. If everything seems a little low to you... Shit. Fuck. Talk about a butt clencher moment. Yeah, this is definitely a, uh, only two kills this trip, for sure. But to be fair, I used, like, fucking ten sharks. First kill here. It's bullshit. It's bullshit! There we go. Man, I about got, I about got fucked there, though. Your noob senses are tingly. Tingling. Well, you might be at the wrong stream, bro, because I have higher range than you now, so... Now, if you mean noob as in, as in total level, then then yeah, I'll give you that one. Because I know your total level's much higher. Uh, yeah. Teleport to house. Uh, can, can you hear the music all right, Dragon? Like, I have it kind of low on my, um... I kind of have it low on my headset... But that's because I 
I kind of want to take priority actually here for Kath's um, cries or whatever you want to call it. His attacks. Hell, I don't even have a clue what music is playing right now. Something from Age of Empires too. I think Funky would know about that, wouldn't he? Heck if I know. This sounds familiar to me. What is this from? It's much lower than my voice, that's for sure. I mean, that's a good thing. I mean, I, I did technically lower it on uh, Streamlabs a bit. L like I said, I, I feel like I do a little bit better when I can actually hear his attacks. At least that's what I've conditioned myself to do. You know, I'm almost at 300 kills here. Or, I mean, I told you 300, but really I had like two, 294, 296. I mean, close enough, whatever. Whatever. Oh, I forgot to... Forgot to drink that. I mean, I, I can tell Rigger's doing a little bit more damage against this dude, but... Like, it doesn't seem like it's really that much different, in my mind. Could be wrong. I, mean, I could always use one of those combat training dummies to really determine if it's if it's better or not. The volume's fine, okay. Yeah, I just thought I'd uh, finally do a little Warcat killing on stream. Hopefully die for you guys, although I'm going to try not to. But then again, this is it's kind of difficult to not fuck up, even though I've killed him a lot. On the plus side, I should get 89 range here pretty soon. Should. I'll put it on the tracker here in a bit. Okay, that's 251. Swap. Hit you again. Man, it'd be fucking insane if I got like a massage or a... Or something crazy like that. Although, personally, at this point in time, I'd much rather have, like, the Skeletal Visage, because it's worth the most. I mean, no, it drops some kind of necklace, which isn't really worth jack. I don't even know what it's good for. I'm pretty sure it's tradable, though. At least I'm taking less damage this time. This sounds like it's an RPG for sure. Whatever. Oh, I guess I got lucky there. Hey, what is this from? Oh, Breath of Fire 4, okay. Yeah, I could see that. Yeah. I think, uh... I'm trying to remember if I have 3 or 4. I know I have one of the Breath of Fire games I got for, uh... The PlayStation 1. Or, like, on, um... PSN or whatever. I think it was when there was a sale, they were, like, super cheap. I want to say it was 4. But I, I think 3 was also on the PlayStation as well. But yeah, not sure how long I'm necessarily going to go for this. I guess until I run out of su supplies. Oh, that was bullshit. Normally they don't have 3 acid pools in a row straight like that. That's kind of bad luck. Piece of shit. A little bit slower on reacting here. That's because I'm streaming. I'm nervous. Nervous. You know, there's probably guys who could do this on mobile. There's no way I could do it. No fucking way. Ooh. I mean, I know there are guys who uh, have done Zolra on mobile, which, hell, I can barely tolerate him in any regard. Fucking hate Zolra. Doesn't matter, this guy's worth more money per hour anyway. Like, Zolra was good back... I mean... Basically before this... You see, it's lagging on me now, you piece of shit game. 
You fucker. See? Lag just fucking killed me. Stupid cunt. You see that that's one thing you have to that's one thing you have to figure about this. The lag will fuck you up no matter how good you are. There's no way I could have avoided that. Fucking bitch. Like I said, it is just 100k, though. Hopefully that doesn't happen again. Piece of fucking... Yeah. It's... Uh, I've already forgotten it. It just it sucks because I have to go basically all the way back there, buy my shit, and then go to Lunar Isle to uh, restock the sharks that I already used, you know what I mean? It's annoying. Yeah, thank god you can just pay for your shit back. Got lunar tabs? No, I don't. I probably should. Uh, okay, put that shit on. I forgot your your runes actually get um taken out of there, don't they? Like I don't die, I don't die too much to him nowadays, but it's still fucking annoying. But like I said, lag can kill you no matter what. I I just think it's easier to teleport to a house and then just use their altar thing. I don't have a lunar like portal at my actual house, otherwise I'd probably use that instead. There we go. Of course I gotta set up my shit again. Well, just real quick, let me. Let me add that. Yeah, 95% of the way to 89 range. Oh, don't do that. Don't do that. Deposit that. Do that. 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 Deposit that. Yeah, my bank is is quite the mess. Not gonna deny that. Wait, why is that there? My bad. Yeah, you would think I would clean out more of my bank, uh, just to get, like, a little bit more money for, for, like, whatever I'm trying to buy, the, the oak planks to train construction, but, you know. Alright, let's go back. Hopefully I don't get fucking lag again. I actually forgot you could hit the travel Fremenic boat there to actually go to the island. I usually just right click the guy. I'm sure that's an XP waste right there, but you know, suck it. This is definitely an NES game. What is this? Did, did that say trading card game? What is this? What is it, Yu Gi Oh? Oh no, it's from the Pokemon trading card game. You know, I've always thought about playing that. If it's talking about the Game Boy Color game that's like a has like a black cartridge. I've always thought about playing that. I, I I'm trying to remember if I actually have that on um uh, on the Game Boy Color not. Like I might have bought it bought it at a yard sale or what have you. Like I wonder how fun that is. Kind of a nice little song. Like like when I was younger, I always got into um, the Yu-Gi-Oh card game, like actually playing the card game. But Pokemon, I just collected the cards and kind of stared at them, kind of like what my nephew does now. So it's kind of interesting. Okay, don't get hit by the fireball. I almost feel like that fireball attack shouldn't even exist. It's just anything that one hit kills you, I think should be removed from pretty much every game in existence. 
Like, I don't care what kind of game we're talking about. There we go. Yeah, getting that range experience. Hit him one more time. Okay, probably two more times. There we go. Under 265. I've heard that actually supposedly, um... Like, the moment you should switch actually scales with your range level, but I, I just say 265 and... Under that, I say it's good to go. Or as close to it as possible. And this sounds like... This song sounds like it should be on Genesis or something. Might. It might. Come on. Alright, maybe we'll actually do three kills this... This, uh... This trip. Unless lag decides to kill me again, which I wouldn't doubt it. This is the first time I've, I've streamed a boss, but... I mean, unless you count Barrows, I suppose. A lot of people call that a minigame, though. Alright, that wasn't too bad. I guess Funk's still doing his thing. Oh, don't do that. I'm sure he probably, uh... He probably noticed I went live, and he's like, Oh my god, he's playing Run Escape, blah, blah, blah. Hopefully he's, he's getting fucking wrecked. There we go. Like I said, I always hate this part. This is, this is probably what killed me more than the acid pools. Um, at the start, because the thing is, like, if you don't fucking spam click where your character is, uh, when he, when he freezes you in place, you're gonna have a bad time, needless to say. Alright. Okay, finish that bitch off. I like how he just randomly has, like, 20,000 coins on him. It's like, where'd he get that shit, you know? Goddamn. Okay, 370. Come on. I, I still feel like you should be able to hit more accurate, accurately. Even as I am right now. It's like, come on. I have almost 90 range. It's like, what do they expect? Like I said, I, I basically have all the best... Uh, like, equipment except for the Ranger boots, which... Who gives a rat's ass about those? Like, honestly. Oh. Yeah, I, I probably have enough food to, to do one more kill here. You're gonna go live shortly? Oh. Okay. So much for somebody watching me. Oh well. It is what it is. Eat a dick. Knowing me, I'll, I'll run out of supplies early, so... Might not even last an hour and a half. Come on, dude. Still haven't bothered to learn the uh, Wooks walk yet, because it's I don't I don't even think it's worth my time to try to learn. There we go. Got something rare for me? No. Oh shit! I forgot that was uh. There we go. I'm just curious. What are you having for lunch, Dragon? Just curious. I actually thought about um uh trying to get some more money in Hollow Knight. Like apparently like the very starter of the game, like the area kinda switched. Ooh, ooh, don't die, don't die. 
So like I'm I'm kind of curious if the enemies in the first area will drop more geos if I kill them. So that way I'm not really like spoiling anything. I mean I mean there is a bank so so it'll help secure some money when I'm not actually streaming the game. I just don't lag. Just don't lag on me, bro. Please. And what an adventurous song this is, damn. Sounds like it could even be from a Dragon Quest game, maybe. Come on. Alright. Time to switch. Come on. Alright. Yeah, like, what'll happen is if, uh, when he freezes you and you don't bother to, like, spam click and shit, uh, you basically will not be able to, uh, uh, crumble undead that, that little guy that goes after you. So it ended up hitting you again. It's bullshit. It's bullshit. I thought I could make it. I, I drank just in case, you know. Whatever. Me love mac and cheese, fried okra, and turnip greens. Um, the first three sounds pretty good. I don't know about turnip greens. But there's some crazy guys that can do like five or six kills an hour. I, I'm not that good, for sure. Typically, I do around... Um, Typically, I do around three. Because I fucking suck. I guess we're going to Norp's place. Okay. For some reason, this jackass has his no, Nexus here and he has a, a throne rune. Why the hell he even has one of those is beyond understanding. Let's see, how, how close am I to a 13k? Oh, that's only like three more kills. Oh, I actually got some battle staffs. Cool. I like to rush. I like to refresh these potions like every time, just in case, you know. Probably should have bought some more sharks, but. Oh, I do have some mana rays I can use too. I mean, if I was like really, really elite, I'd probably be using manta rays. Although I know you can. Um, some people just use um, mana rays and, and carom wands for like one tick heals. Maybe I'll do that at some point. I don't know. You know, like if I was gonna do like thousands and thousands of Warcath kills, uh, you know, I might consider it. So far, I'd say my goal is probably about 500 kills. You know, until you know, and then I'll take a good a good break from it. You know, you know, I do want to get some good shit. This song sounds familiar too. Might be Final Fantasy. Might turn up the volume of the music just a little bit. Because it is good. Gotta pay attention to that. Divine Range Potion here. Those are great. Or Divine Bastion Potions. Dude. Okay, six more seconds. Three, two, one. You see, this is why I waited. Because that has priority over pretty much everything. Alright, 348. Health. Uh, I know I'm poisoned. Yeah, you got you gotta be on your shit. Hell, compared to King Black Dragon, 
Hell, that hell, that's you know, that's that's a fucking baby's game, pretty much compared to compared to trying to do this shit. But yeah, I would I would definitely be up to doing more King Black Dragon, like next month. Hell, fuck it, why not? You know, statistically, you'll probably get ahead by then. This totally sounds like Final Fantasy music. Oh, you fuck not. Alright, come on. Shit, at this rate, I'll only have enough for two kills here. God damn it. Sometimes I, like, go half and half, like half mana rays, half sharks, but... That's only if I if I have some from when he kills. I'm like, I don't really go out of my way to buy mana rays. Because I'm a cheap bastard. Ooh, that was a good hit there. Good 50. I gotta remember my, uh, I gotta make sure my controller is charged for tomorrow night's, uh, shenanigans. This song sounds familiar from. What is this from? Country, country turnip greens. So it has ham in it. Up in chat so we can talk about the poll for a bit. Uh, yeah, sure, hold on. Uh, in, in your, in your chat or Funkies? Because uh, I can't, I can't use yours because I have to, uh, recent email verification or some shit. I'll be in Funkies though. Hello? Okay, you are way too quiet. Do what? Why am I quiet? Should not be. Well, part of it is because of Streamlabs, part of it is because of my headset and the music being too loud. Gotcha. I'm gonna lower the music a bit. Oh, wait, uh, what's up then? All right. Um, I'm just setting up my Spotify and going live right now. We're gonna talk about poll questions. Okay. Beep, beep. Ooh. Fuck you, bitch. I'll be honest. I thought I'd be failing more doing this. It's good that you aren't. It's good for me. Less money I have to waste on a, uh, you know. Coming back. Or, you know, getting my shit. I think I always come back when I die in RuneScape. I don't know. It, it seems to be, you know, it seems to be the law. Come on, you fucker. Uh, is, uh, so, so that, um, uh, what do you want to call it? That Soul Wars thing, is that still around or was that literally just for that event? Because I never played it. I don't know if it's for that event or not. Like, I mean, I assumed it was a permanent just addition to the game. <clears throat> and they were just celebrating shit, you know, just for the occasion. I'm hoping it's just part of the game. Yeah, I would, I would think. I would like to go back and look at it eventually. Like, I don't know if there is, like, any special award, uh, reward you could do. I mean, I know, like, in, um, you could launch fireworks in, like, the Varrock Square. That was kind of amusing. Oh, well. 
they'll have another celebration in another 10 years, so. Well. Actually, they'll have another in like five years. Oh, they go by multiples of five? Yep. Every five years they have one. Oh, I'm being a dummy. I forgot to switch my shit. And let me set up my dashboard. Stupid FML. And you're dead, sir. <sighs> yeah, officially passed 300 kills now, so. Yay. Nice. Yeah. 300, man. So, so in theory, I'm a tenth of the way to a pet then, right? In theory. Uh, something like that. Yeah. Alright, so, poll questions. Okay. Question number one is, should the number of total unique items you have obtained be added to the top of the collection log? Uh, read that again. Should the total number of unique items you have obtained be added to the top of the collection log? I mean, yeah, I don't see why not. Yep, same here. I mean, <laughs> like, who's going to bitch about that? You know what I mean? Yeah, it's also just, hey, you've collected X amount of the total uniques in the game. Yeah. I don't so, yeah, that's that. why I said, yes, it's just like a no-brainer quality of life type of thing. Hell, hell, there, hell there's, awesome. there's one on there that was like, it was like a such, oh my god, yes, please, that <laughs> I can't imagine anyone would go against it. I, it had to do with like, um, it was asking if um, if it was going to give like a, a lesser hit, like accuracy when someone used like Ice Barrage in the wilderness, if you had like, like Dragon Hide Armor on or something like that. And I was like, oh god, yes, for sure. It, like it was something related to Ice Barrage in the wilderness. And I was like, yeah, anything that can prevent me from getting owned by it more, yeah. By all means, nerf it. Fuck them. Alright, question number two. Should the color of each selection within the collection log change when they have been fully completed? I don't see why not. Yeah, that would just... I mean, a little... I mean, doesn't Rune Light already kind of do that for you? I don't know. I've never got a collection log and completed a section. Ooh. So. It sounds like something Rune Light would do. I say, yeah, go ahead. Like, have it be highlighted in blue or green when you have all the uniques for a monster. Why not? Yeah, I don't see any reason why I wouldn't do that. Um, should the collection log show the kill count for each mode of the content? For example, challenge mode, chambers of Zeric, corrupted, gauntlet, and the individual Dagonoth kings would each show their respective kill counts. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, it already shows that on the Ring of Wealth, doesn't it? Something like that. Should gilded and third age pieces from the hard, elite, and master clue scrolls sections be separated into their own sections so it's more feasible to complete them. Hard elite, master, mega rare, clue scroll sections would be added specifically for these items. Uh, um, maybe? That seems kind of a loaded question to me. Oh, hell yeah. They're showing, uh, I'm hearing Ocarina of Time music right now. Okay, so this is specifically talking about Gilded and Third Age. And uh, they are mega rare shit. Yeah. I want to say no. And the reason I want to say no is because the hard clue scroll rewards are all within the hard clue scroll. And there, I don't see a reason why you would separate that. I mean, yeah, I, I think it's fine the way it is. I don't know. If, if I, like, actually... Oh, I thought I got something better. The fuck? Okay, that's weird. Normally it doesn't highlight rune longswords in green, but I actually got six of them. What the fuck? That's unusual. Interesting. Uh, I mean, the most I ever get of rune longsword is swords is four. So I guess that's why it highlighted in green, because it, it treats it as the total value of the stack, you know? Mm-hmm. 
That's weird. Yeah, that's never happened. Huh. Okay, so next question is, should we update the side panel as shown in the blog? You can open the collection log from it without needing the book. Uh, hell yeah! So... I'd say hell yeah to that. In, they add in a another tab next to your, like, questing tab. You know how you got the different questing tabs there? Yeah, like your Zaya houses, minigame teleports, all that stuff. Yeah, they just add an extra tab in there. Oh, uh, hell to the yeah! Again, and why would anyone has say your no? Combat level, total level, total XP is listed, your quest points is listed, achievement completed. It actually has achievements, what? I mean, I mean, they they basically have a tab just like that in RS3 anyway, so... Combat task completed collection. So, it, it looks like they're trying to expand... Um, what is this thing called? The adventure path as well. Yeah, like I said, they basically do it in RS3, so... Yeah, I don't see any reason why yeah. they have to do that. Yeah, why not? You can look at all your all your collection shit without having to interact with a book that's in your bank or whatever. Yeah, why not? Uh, should a search function be added to the collection log? Allow players to search for specific items or bosses based on the section they're in. Yes. Fuck yes. Absolutely. I need to do this poll after the stream here. <laughs> it, like, all of these are, yeah, of course, why not? You know? Even if it's should not check. something I'm super into, like, it only makes the game, you know more user experience friendly so yeah why not um should a tracker be added to the collection log showing how many times a player has completed the gnome restaurant minigame if this section passes only new completions after the update will be tracked sure sure now why you'd want to do gnome restaurant is beyond me but um there's some um uh, 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 cosmetic things that you can get from there. Well, whatever. Well, I don't remember what they are, but I know there's some things you can get from it. Uh, but Shit. yeah, I don't see why not for those freaks that actually want to do that crappy mini game. Right. <laughs> I mean, I only did it because of the achievement diary. Okay. All right. I think I have enough Question for Question number eight. Yeah, I got enough for Should one kill. Should a toggle be added in-game completion and kill items to allow them to display the exact time instead of a time rounded down to the nearest second? This would allow players to judge their times more accurately based on the game cycle. By default, the option would be toggled off. No. And the reason I say no is because. I'm sorry. If Ooh, you 89 range, of... bitches. Congrats, dude. Yeah. But if people are tracking that closely, they uh, they might be able just... to exploit it, the fuck no, out no. of it. If they're tracking that closely anyway, they're going to have a timer outside the game that will track in the millisecond. Yeah, because there are some meta freaks out there. I want to say no because... That our devs need to be focused on something else. That's the only reason why. Not because it isn't helpful. So you're saying just just leave that to the freaks who want to delve into that, but focus time on other things. Right. That'll help the average guy. Uh huh. I mean, it's kind of an either or question for me. I'll have to think about it a little later. I mean, not. it's an either or question for me as well, but I'd rather the devs work on something more important. That's all it is. That's why I said no. Okay. Um, question number nine. Should a transmog option be added to the baby Ooh. mole pet, allowing players to use a mole claw on it to turn it into baby mole rats? Hell yeah, that skin could be used to revert the transformation. That sounds awesome, yeah. Why not? And basically, it turns it into a skinless mole. How is that not awesome? Yeah, I say go ahead. Oh, by the way, Final Fantasy X music playing. I even know the soundtrack. It's uh, Someday the Dream Will End, and it's fucking epic. I'm not going to lie. This thing looks like it's 
a walking brain. <laughs> Dude, I'm gonna have to teleport out. I'm out of food. Shit. It looks like a fucking walking brain. Whatever. I wasn't gonna kill it. Fucker. At least I only, I think I only left some, uh, some dragon hide. Like, just the regular blue one, so... It's not that big a deal. I want to say yes, just for more variety on pets. I, I think it sounds Whatever. awesome. It, it, it looks like a walking brain. That's, that's cool. We need a walking brain. <laughs> oh, I forgot to hit the goddamn... Damn it. <clears throat> Should a ch small chest be added outside the theater blood entrance, allowing players to claim any loot they missed out on from their previous completion? Yeah. This chest contains an item that is normally broadcast to the raiding party. Then they will receive the broadcast if the party member was present at the time. Uh, yeah, sure. Yeah. Quality of life? Yeah. I mean, if you, you know, I, I've heard you can only really do at the most like two raids an hour. So, you know, say you lagged out and you died and you basically got fucked, at least there's something you can get then. Yep. You know, kind of like when I got killed by Gvorkath there, you know, like 10 minutes ago. Should the Jar of Spirits be added to Corporeal Beast Loot Table? This jar can be used to showcase your very own Corporeal Beast in your playing own house. Inclusion of the jar would not impact the drop rate of existing unique items and would have a drop rate of 1,000. 1 in 1,000. Yeah. Sure. Whatever. Sounds cool. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not ever going to like farm for that, but sure. Yeah, I wouldn't either. Question 12. Should the junk drops such as tinder boxes, fire talismans, and bullseye lantern on the thermonuclear smoke devil's loot table be made rarer? Improving the overall average value of the drop. Uh, Rate of attaining unique items will not be impacted by this change. I would say, yeah, probably do that. Well, honestly, it's best just to remove that shit, in my opinion. Who the fuck wants a tender box? Like, you know what I mean? I'm looking at their table. You said a fire talisman, uh, something else, and, uh... And a and a tender box is on the th thermonuclear smoke devils. Tender box, fire talisman, and bullseye lantern. Just take it off that. Like just get just get rid of it. That's what I would say. Um. Who the fuck I thought that was a good idea? See... Don't you need like ninety four Slayer to even kill that bitch? Mmm. Ninety three. Yeah. Yeah. Some dumbass. Some dumbass needs to take that off the table. It's 1 in 42 chance to get a bullseye lantern. Yeah. 1 in 12 to get a tinderbox. 1 in 32 to get a fire talisman. Those are way low, bro. But it's it, it, should, it still shouldn't be on there, in my opinion. I mean, there has to be some junk items. But dude, like you need 93 essence. Slayer to kill it. I, I highly disagree on that. If we're talking about a, uh, something you can kill no matter what level you are... Sure, everything needs junk items. But I think in the 90s for Slayer, I disagree. Eh, everything needs some kind of junk item, but it should not be a 1 in 12. Well, we're just going to have to agree, agree to disagree on this. Like, the tinder box should be like 1 in 200. Now, I'm not saying every... Just as a joke item. Now, I'm not saying every little thing, you know, uh, high Slayer-wise needs needs to be worth like half a mil. I'm not saying that, but seriously, like a, a 2 GP item from a 93 Slayer monster is a fucking joke. That's what I'm saying. There should be a joke item. Well, Every monster has a joke item. Well, I'm not laughing. <laughs> that was a fake laugh, by the way. Uh-huh. Yeah. That, that was totally a laugh. <laughs> you want to hear laughs, you should... Wait until tomorrow. You'll be getting some laughs from me. But yeah, if they make that like 1 in 200, I would absolutely be okay with that. Yeah, 1 in 200 sounds about right. Alright. Um... 
Let's see, how long am I going for? Has it really been over 40 minutes? Mm -mm -mm. I mean, there's some epic music playing right now. Should a jar of smoke be added to the thermonuclear smoke bill loot table? Sure. At rate of 1 in 2,000. Sure, why not? Yeah, I don't see any reason why not. I, I, I keep forgetting what those jars actually do. Don't they recolor something? Hey, Devil's Reject. Yes, we are geeking out. Yup, pretty much. We are going through the poll and finding out what the hell is here. <laughs> yup. Uh, should there be a small chance of receiving a bird egg's nest when emptying a full birdhouse? Bird egg nest? Uh, um, this I thought that already exists. To impact a seed nest if you would otherwise receive. I thought that already exists, but yeah, I don't see why not. I mean, it is a birdhouse. Yeah. You know, it's not. Know. It's not unreasonable to find a nest nest in there. Yeah, as long as it doesn't affect seeds, I don't care. Yeah. You gave me a VIP role in your Discord. I haven't really looked at the Discord. I just saw it pop up while I was reading other stuff. Man, I gotta step up my follower gain. You have almost 100 <laughs> followers, man. What's up with that? It's probably because of that Slayer thing you're doing. No worries. You busy streaming? Yeah. I, uh... I, I'm thoroughly enjoying my RuneScape streams. I don't know why. I, I don't know why chill, either. listen to music and... do random polls. <laughs> There's no consistency on them. Old memories? No, it's not even that. It... A lot of the stuff I don't even remember doing. Like... We did a whole bunch of quests earlier. I, when I did uh, Ernest the Chicken, I didn't remember any of that. What up, Shoddy? How you doing, bro? Shoddy in your stream? Mm hmm. Tell him I oh. said hi, assuming he can hear me. Or he can't hear me. Uh, I can fix that. It don't oh. matter. Hey, Shoddy, you can hear my dude that's talking to me now. <laughs> uh, should I. Yeah, I might as well FML, just... say hi. Hi, shoddy. There you go. <laughs> I'm being a nerd in Run Escape, so... You know. Probably could have killed three of them, but... Whatever. Multi stream. I might as well throw down his link for multi-stream. Well, I've, I highly doubt he cares about watching Run Escape. Never know. Don't, don't, if don't you under, don't whatever. you understand? Shoddy, Shoddy's only game is Dark Souls related content. I know. So maybe I know that. There you go. You can see what he's doing. My screen is pretty boring. <laughs> I mean, mine will be less boring if I die, but I'm gonna try to avoid that. Yep, I got affiliate. Uh, yesterday morning? Yup. And, he, and he's, I mean, technically he's already ahead of me. In terms of clout. So bravo. Dude, it's because of the warrior family. You think? Devil, he's been supporting me since day one. I've oh hell yeah, there. dude. This is Kingdom Hearts 2 music. That is a weird ass song. Scares, scarzo di note. I don't have a fucking clue how to pronounce that. <laughs> it's from the first Kingdom Hearts. It's like battle music. So confusing what is happening here. So, FML is killing a boss for monies. Who's the weirdo I'm playing with? That's him. I am pretty weird. So like, you know. Not gonna deny FML that. Is a buddy of mine that I've known for what, two years now? Uh 
I guess since Funky stuck to doing Twitch, how long, however long that was. Four years? Really? Nah, I don't think it was that long. I don't know. Just yeah. uh, two years is fine, whatever. <laughs> whatever. Between two to four years, somewhere in there. I'm just a scrub from Indiana, no need to, you know, acknowledge me. All they're following. Oh, this was a guy lonely and begging for followers. Jeez. Yeah, exactly, right? <laughs> Fucking loser. He's just quit. The trash man over here. That's all he is. Yup. Just keep throwing more trash in that dumpster, man. Yup. All right, question 15. Should we increase the maximum number of charges the amulet of Blood Fury can hold from 10,000 to 30,000? If this question passes, it will be possible to recharge the existing amulet of Flurry by Shit. using blood shards on it to replenish up to 10,000 charges. Newly crafted amulets of Fury would still start with 10,000. Sure. I don't see why yeah. not. God damn, you'd have to have fat More pockets to do ready. that. Yeah. Because I know that that amulet is not cheap to maintain. Thank you, Shoddy. It's because of all of you that I actually got it. Yep. Even this loser I'm talking to right now. Hi. Ah, <laughs> 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 uh, shit. Is there a point the dodging when all is hitting him? Damn. You must be doing really bad at your Slayer. Your, uh, Vorkath villain. I just suck at games, pretty much. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you might have heard me say that before, you know. Okay, that actually looks pretty badass. Um, Part of his sixteen is: Should it be possible for Patchy the pirate to combine Dark Claw from Schizo and flippers from the Mogers to create dark flippers. The dark flippers are a cosmetic alternative to flippers and maintain some the same functionality as the original. Sure. It, they're like black all the way across, but with purple like toes on the flipper. I mean, even if it's cosmetic, it's still giving a use for an item that maybe not a lot of people care to have. Like, you know what I mean? I don't even know what Dark Claw does normally. Uh, I don't remember either. I don't but. remember it doing anything. So, it it gives somewhat of a purpose to a useless item. I think that's fine, even if it's just cosmetic. Okay, the Dark Claw, when used with the Slayer Helm, makes it into a purple Slayer Helm. Oh. That's it. I mean, that would be a pretty badass Slayer Helmet, but... Hell, I can already make two two different ones right now if I really wanted to. I could make the Vorkath one in the uh, King Black Dragon. But I don't want to waste a thousand Slayer points just on that, you know what I mean? <laughs> that seems, you know... Eventually, little... you'll get to a point where the Slayer points won't matter. True. I just hit my 200 Slayer, and that shit gave me um, almost 2,000 Slayer points. Very nice. Mm-hmm. Just rolling in it. Rolling. Pretty sure I'm hearing Parasite Eve music right now. Which is a pretty good game. Should players with level 40 construction be able to create a stash unit tracker within their player owned house as a new option for the wall chart? Upon clicking the stash unit tracker, an interface would open showing the player where all stash unit locations are and whether they have built and filled them. Yeah. Fuck yes. Fuck yeah, dude. I could make one right now, then. <laughs> with my shitty Slayer uh, construction level. Dude, that would be so fucking helpful. Yeah, that would. I I would actually go even farther on this one. I would say make it a um, progressible construction thing to where at level... I think it's level 30... No. Yeah, I think it's level 32. I think it's level 32 construction. You yeah. can build the first uh, beginner stash. 
so at level 32 you get the beginner stash upgrade for this and then once you get to uh medium you can get the medium upgrade to this and it attract the medium tracker units so basically you know have saying? it have it an upgradable device mm -hmm. what what oh thanks for the uh uh sub funky i'll read your message in a sec i know you're trying to kill me there with that because <laughs> you know what i'm doing takes a fair amount of concentration or you just figured. There's no way you'd ever play RuneScape to where you're killing this boss, that's for fucking sure. But yeah, that's what I would do if I was the one with the stash unit thing. Yeah, I, I don't see why not. I think it sounds awesome, because I definitely have not made all the stash units. Even on my main account, I, I oh, don't no. think I've gotten all the uh, oh, no. medium stashes. Oh my fucking... I got lagged again. I didn't die, though, surprisingly. Fucking bitch. Question eighteen. I mean, I'm I sure I've made. Questions there are. I'm sure I've made 800k by now, at least. There's 29 questions. Holy shit. Well, that's a big poll. Yeah. Question eighteen. Should a new shortcut be added to the cliff in BLD caves? I don't even know how to say that. B i y e l d i. Out. Where is that? I I don't know. Allowing players to scale down the cliff faster than if they were to manually navigate their way down. Shortcut would require 91 agility and a long rope from Darkmire General Store to complete. Long rope be, will only be required once to unlock shortcut. I don't uh, see why not. Yeah, I don't. I don't, I don't see is. why not. B i y e l d. That is a damn high agility level, though. Um, search. Must be a hell of a shortcut, I guess. Shit. Apparently, the rune tracker doesn't even fucking know where it is. Oh. Okay. E I Y E L D. It it doesn't even know where the mountains are. I mean, it mentioned Darkmire. Doesn't that refer to uh, uh, Mauritania then? Somewhere. Ah, oh, crap. Because I was doing said... Darkness of Hallowvale a couple days ago, so. That was the only one I said no to, I think. Hurry up and kill uh, me, fucker. Redo my questions. Uh, don't freeze me. <clears throat> I forgot when you get out of the poll, it resets your poll unless you submit. That's a yes. Oh, you That's said yo, yo, yo. Also, hey, hey, shoddy, how's it going, man? All right, question 19. Should imps, blood veils, all variants, ice fiends, water fiends, pyre fiends include superiors, pyre lords including superiors, and poras delir, poras delir, deer, whatever, be classified as demons in game to match the lore surrounding them? If this question passes, items with bonus towards demons such as the arc light will also be effective against these hell fucking yes. Oh, uh, what's the enemy? Uh, Pyre Fiends, Pyre Lords, Ice Fiends, Water Fiends, oh. uh, Blood Velds, Imps. That sounds... Yes! God, yes! Yeah, because all of those are classified as demons of some type. And I yeah. was questioning that a long time ago. Why does the Arclight only work on greater demons and lesser demons? Hell yeah. Immediately. Oh, this is a Zelda question for sure. Thank you for that host, Del Reject. Isn't this, uh... Hyrule I'll check Field. Out later, man. I think this is Hyrule Field. I know it's from Twilight Princess. Oh, staff roll number one. Oh, so it's part of the credits. My bad. Huh? God, that okay, game's so amazing. This question is for players who have engaged in PvP on PvP worlds in recent months. Should it be possible to use Vesta's longsword in combat against other players in PvP worlds? Longsword would lose all bonuses when used against NPCs, effectively turning it into a cosmetic item. So Funky, how was your uh how's your little stream there, huh? Huh? Pretty pretty interesting, huh? Oh, so you actually have to participate like right now in a PvP world to even do that? Oh yeah. Yeah, I think I heard there are there are certain 
PvP pulls that that only let you do it if you've killed a certain amount amount of players or something. So makes sense. I mean, it totally does make sense because I don't PvP. Yeah, I neither do I. I want to put no to begin with. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I probably would too. Um, question twenty one: Should a parasite's mechanic in the Nightmare <laughs> of Ash Ashhama? These game is good. I mean, pretty much all of them are are good, funky. I mean, people give shit to like the first couple ones. Um. Although I haven't played them. Ease 3, which is... Yeah, the first couple are dog shit. Ease 3, which is more or less a Zelda 2 clone, I actually thought was rather decent. Um, although it's pretty easy to uh, to break that game. Should a parasite mechanic of Nightmare of Ashama encounter be changed so that the amount of heal is more consistent rather than rolling a random number between 1 to the maximum amount until they are killed? I mean, I don't see why not. It'd make it easier for literally everyone to learn him, so... Or her, so I don't see why not. I'm just confused as to why they had it as the maximum amount. Because they're, they're fucking stupid? <laughs> I mean... Because that means they could fully heal. Yeah. Wow. That'd be a real dick just, move, wouldn't wow. it? Okay, question 22. Should... All of the blighted items available in the Last Man Standing store also be added to the Soul Wars store. Each blighted item will cost 10 zeal to purchase. It would not be possible to sell these items back to the store for zeal. Uh, so maybe wouldn't that just be like the um, the 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 pickaxe? I, I forget what they used to call them from Soul Wars. Soul Wars? I don't think I ever really played that back in the day. RS3 Soul Wars. We'll just look it up. We're looking up everything else. I go for it. You're the you're the look up guy right now. I'm the don't get killed guy. <laughs> Dude. But yeah, funky. So I I ordered that um thingy mabob. I think it said it'll be here by the 23rd. And of course, I'll have to test it out with my uh, system. I mean, it, I know my GameCube works. I actually, technically, I have two of them. But I'm kind of looking forward to playing Majora's Mask again, to be honest. And this time, I'll actually 100%. And I played it on the 3DS maybe about four years ago. But I just did the bare minimum. Because it's, uh, it's not an easy thing to 100% Majora's Mask. Okay, so they have a gamble system where you can get a whole bunch of different stuff. And okay. they have trophies you can get. Okay. You can get fire cape off of that? Really? What? Really? You can get a fire really? cape? In RuneScape 3, yeah. Wow, that's... It's 100 zeal points and you can just buy a fire cape. That's... That's fucking stupid. Yeah. Like, I know it's easy scape, but goddamn. I guess it turned into Pussyscape now, didn't it? It's been Pussyscape. Um, pickaxe. Wow, that's, yeah. <laughs> Although, to be fair, Firekeep in RS3 isn't jack shit. So, you know. Like, I think it's, I think it's only just as good as any other skill cape for the most part. Volatile clay pickaxe. I think that's what I was thinking of. Uh -huh. Um. Come on, you fucker. Yeah, I'm sorry I can't keep up with the chat so much. It's I'm trying not to die. I did actually get killed once from the fucking lag, but that was not my fault. Yeah, this is from Stealing Creation. So oh, they're... that minigame. I actually liked that minigame back in the day. So they want to add those, um, like, things to Soul Wars? Or have an upgraded version of other things? Uh... Maybe. I, I don't know. 
I don't know enough about it. Yeah. Because I never played Last Man Standing, so I don't know what the blighted items are. Yeah, me neither. Um, uh, old school RuneScape blighted items. Okay, what maybe I can actually Angler kill Angler Fish Carbon Bun. How are you saying that? Bon. Ray, Super yeah. Restore. Bind sack and tangle sack. Come on, you piece Snare of shit. Sack, ancient ice sack, teleport spell sack, vengeance sack, blight its longsword. How many times did you say sack there? God damn. You like my sack. You will love my sack. I doubt it. Um. Maybe maybe we should do a sack stream. Yeah, we just, should. Yeah, just put sacks in front of the camera and there you go. <laughs> <laughs> Be like, there's your stream, guys. Don't forget to follow and subscribe. <laughs> oh, I'm fucking crazy. All right, blighted teleport spell sack are an item that allows player to cast tele block and teleport to target without needing the runes for it. However, it can only be used inside the wilderness. Uh, okay. Uh, when I when I go back to bank, I'll look at your comments, guys. I'm sorry. It's just, my muscle memory basically says, you know, to stay at the, stay looking at the screen the entire time. I thought blighted mana rays were already added to the game. Uh, I think they have blighted other foods, don't they? Like blighted yeah, shark? I, yeah, they do, but I thought they were already added to the game. I heard they even... I, I don't see a reason why that wouldn't be a good thing. Because Blighted stuff seems to be only PK related. Yes, for sure. So, if I ever wanted to PK, Blighted stuff sounds good to me. Yeah. Whatever. Whatever. Follow and subscribe, don't be pushy. Shoddy. I don't even say that when people are here. <laughs> yeah, I don't. I was being facetious. Every once in a while, I might remember at the very end of the show. Oh shit! But whatever. Oh, tits. Holy tits! Almost hit me with his acid. Question twenty-three: If blighted items are added to Soul Wars Rewards Shop, should it also be possible to use the spell sacks within the mini game? It would not be possible to use blighted food or potions. Ah, hmm. oh, no, Shadi. I mean, that that sounds like a balance, I guess. I don't know. Like, I don't know anything about the PvP, uh, you know, scheme. Uh, so, Ooh. it's basically taking the spells and they're combined into a sack instead of using runes for it. That's all it is. Okay. So, I don't see a reason why not. Because you're taking extra time and effort to get one of those sacks instead of just going to get a couple of runes. Wait, is it just so it takes up one inventory slot. Okay, sorry. Let me look at your actual comments here. Oh, a lot of it was just talking to, to Funky, huh, Shoddy? Yeah, yeah. Oh, you didn't actually finish Resident Evil 1, Funky? I thought you did. I thought you plowed through that shit. What? What? The hell is that? Oh! Thank you for following, uh... Jose, Joe's Joe's Mole Twenty. Thank you for following, sir. I gotta even know he was in there. I hope you're having a good time. Hello, Joe. Hope you're joyous talking about polls and him failing at Vorkath. Probably be late Friday. Oh, you were you're, yeah you were teasing about that. I kind of thought you were. Hard for me to get jokes through text. I don't know if it's just me. <laughs> yeah, I did put Resident Sleeper up there multiple times. Fucking hate how slow that game is. Nah, I those games are just too slow paced for me. Um, I mean my, well, I'm I'm pretty much still a re you're talking about Resident Evil, right? Yep. I'm very much uh still a noob at it. I do plan on playing Nemesis later this year 
My only real problem with 2 is that every fucking zombie is a goddamn bullet sponge. Like, literally every single zombie. That's really my only problem with the game. Now, like, I did not have that hard a time uh, killing the zombies in Resident Evil 1. Well, the, the GameCube remake, I, I can't... You know, I can't talk about the original. Because, uh, honestly, I'll probably never play the original. It's I don't think it's... Probably not worth my time. Shoddy, my choices in games are pretty unique to begin with. Like, I could literally play a brand new game every single time that none of y'all stream or even play. Like, Satisfactory? Exactly. I can, I can play games like that all the time. It's, it's not... And y'all be like, what's this game? And a lot of y'all would just not come around because y'all didn't see it before and y'all might want to play it. Um... Sure, like I would Immortals get bored. Phoenix Rising, I would totally stream that every single stream. I, I'll if get I it. People would come on. I'll get it eventually. Yeah, but you wouldn't stick around and watch, would you? No. Exactly. That, that's kind of my point. We'll try <laughs> try failing more. Try try doing that. Dude, I fail all the time in that playthrough. Maybe because you had hard mode initially. No, even at standard mode, shoddy. I felt like every zombie was a bullet sponge in that game. Uh, at least in the first one. Uh, I mean, I, I could be remembering wrong, but in the first one, um, I think they went down a little quicker. Plus, you could literally permanently get rid of them by setting them on fire, which I wish that was in two. That would have been cool. I mean, lighting zombies on fire, how's that not fun? You know what I mean? Boop. I'm, j I'm just a hater, though. Don't tell Mara I'm talking shit about her series. Fucking hater. Hater's gonna hate. Fucking fucking hater. <laughs> <laughs> well, what are you gonna do when she says, uh... Honestly, do you really think she would even play 6? Alright, right, to remake zombies are definitely bullet spines. That's why you use leg technique. Yeah. I've seen y'all do that. I played ALTTP for the first time. Should have streamed it. Was a good time. Dude. Have you started like a stream schedule or like decided to stream more often? Because I haven't seen you even pop up on my mention saying that you were streaming. By the way, I'm skipping question 24 because it's a uh, last man standing map. And it's just saying, hey, do you like what this does for the last, last man standing? So I'm, I'm skipping that one because I don't do last man standing. I know bots typically uh, play that game. Question 25. If the Isle of Souls is updated to allow players to explore it, should a dungeon include a variety of monsters be added to? If the question passes, Konar would be updated to assign greater demons, fire giants, blue dragons, and iron dragons within the dungeon. Sure. Hold up, hold up. Should the Isle of Souls be updated so that it is accessible to players and includes a variety of skilling resources and NPCs described in the blog? What the fuck is the Isle of Souls then? Uh, it sounds like a place that a quest is used at. It's in the western sea west of Fidel Hills. It's where the Soul Wars minigame takes place. Oh. The island is accessible by portal in Edgeville Ruins or the Ferox Enclave Dungeon. I don't see why not. I mean, it sounds like it'd be something used a lot by uh, Iron Man than anything. Oh, 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 I'm seeing it now. So it, the Soul Wars arena is like in the middle. Yeah. And the locations that they're talking about updating are like on the outskirts of the arena. Oh, so it's, it doesn't actually take place within the game. Right. Okay. Yeah, I don't see why not. Yeah. And... Because of that, I'm actually saying yes to question 24, which is saying, hey, do you want to update this map? Which is the Soul Wars map. 
Resident Evil 2 Remake zombies are definitely bullet sponges. That's why you use the leg technique. Yeah, and I'm glad Morrow taught me that, but I still don't think it's enough. Shardy says, nah, I didn't stream it yet. want to get proper setup for it first this time. This mic and headset are terrible. You heard how bad the RE2 rando sounded. Capture card may as well for console. I hear you, Shardy. I just never going to get a capture card. There's too many PC games that I play. Yeah, I was, I was about to say, he's too much of a PC elitist to get a lowly capture card. That's why there's going to be a lot of games that I just won't play. Yeah, and fuck them FML, games. I'm reading your chat too. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. I'm going to start like saying their name so that you know who it is while you're busy doing your killing. Okay. Um... Question 26. If the Isle of Souls dungeon is added to the game, should the end of the dungeon include two Anamite, one Rune Rock in the mine? Yes. Sure. <laughs> they would be from any bank. and require navigation past various monsters. The rocks would be surrounded by aggressive skeletons with an iron dragon nearby. Again, sure. Why not? Sure, whatever. People, Nobody would use it. No, but it's there. Yeah, it'd be there, but nobody would use it. Yeah, what's it? Shardy says, nah, Dragon on no. Would you never play console? And I like it that way since I saw some unique games. Yeah, totally. Unique games is kind of what I'm about. I actually want to go back to Satisfactory because I want to unlock the uh, <laughs> nuclear. Yeah, you want to develop nukes? Hell yeah. O okay, that speaks a lot to your character i guess i want to get you funky and maru in that shit uh just so we can uh it, build it, some shit and uh blow up funky it, that sounds it, like fun it don't seem like that fun to me <laughs> <laughs> oh, question shit. 27 if the Isle of souls dungeon is added to the game should a thieving chest also be added towards the end of the dungeon that can be looted for 115 thieving XP Crap. and a number of items with an average value of approximately 700 coins. And I'm sucking ass sure. right now. I don't even know if I'll have enough for another kill. Shoddy, the multi stream is tomorrow. It's going to be funky. Maro, God Death damn Mello, it. and myself, we're all going to be playing Rocket League about this time tomorrow. Hopefully I can get home early ish. Like earlier than what I said I would. Question 28. If the Isle of Souls is made explorable, should a crumbling tower including 10 forgotten souls also be added? This would be a new ghostly NPC similar to Chaos Druids, but slightly stronger and with a marginally improved loot table sure. sure sounds cool yeah yeah we're only going to do it for like an hour the funky says the earlier the better mara has a short short window to play yeah because uh i think she works in the mornings like mm -hmm. somewhat early mornings If the Cumbling Tower in the dungeon is oh, added to the to... Souls, should the tower include a basement with four chests that are unlocked by using a dark key on them? Dark key would be potentially untradeable reward from chests within the dungeon. Basement chests would reward 1.5k thieving experience and a number of items with an average approximately 30,000 quote Sure, I don't see why not. That's the whole vote! God damn, what a vote. If uh, earlier from now tomorrow, then I'd be able to catch the whole thing. Um, we're looking at trying to start at 11.30 p.m. Which is hour and a half ago. I'm going to try. I'm it kinda, really depends on... It depends scene. on me, kind of. 
but it's not going to be more than an hour, regardless. Yeah, it's not, it's not going to be long. Dude. All right. What quests should I do? What quests should I do? I'm thinking Corin quests. Got to get that favor up. Shadi, I can see you in both chats. <laughs> Dragon sees all. Yeah, it took me like five seconds to pop up both chats. Um, Dwarf Cannon wouldn't be a bad one. Oh, hell yeah. I don't want to do Death Made Plateau it, uh, right now. I wouldn't either. Uh, I'm curious, how much money do I got now? Is that right? Well, I mean, I gotta factor in 2.41 mil. Fuck off, Shoggy. Fuck uh, off. It's probably more like <laughs> 1.9 mil, realistically. Um, which is house? Yeah, I might as well keep going. Like I said, I can keep going basically until I run out of supplies or I hit two hours, either or. According to this, an hour, 25 minutes. I can do some more. Fuck it. FML on time. Ha ha ha. The more reading, you're, the more educated you become, Dragon. I mean, that's kind of the that's kind of the concept behind reading, is it makes you smarter. Clearly, I need to catch up on a lot of other people, huh, Dragon? Yep. Yep. <laughs> Dragon's like, oh god. God help you, FML. <laughs> I, do, I do need to get back into some reading. Like, pretty much everything here is pointing me towards Corind or doing trolls. Yeah. Uh, uh, Funky, I, I got a quick question about Hollow Knight. Um, you know how, like, the beginning area is, like, infected? Like, kind of the, you know, environment was changed or whatever? Are the enemies worth more Geos if I kill them now? Because I thought about actually grinding for a bit of money before Saturday. Like, I, I won't go anything past, like, that beginner area, naturally. I just want some more gold. Or Geos. The ones in that area will drop more, yes. Okay. I might do that for a bit after uh before I go to sleep. I'm doing Plague City. Cause I mean, you know, who the fuck wants to watch me farm geos for the super expensive item, you know? People just want to watch the failure, you know what I mean? It's not about the you know, it's not about the tedious gold farming. It's about the failure, you know? <laughs> And this music is epic as fuck. And I wish I could peek a I wish I could peek at the radio, but Oh, this could be from a fire emblem game for all I know. The the radio I'm using, I think they specifically take a lot from RPGs. I have my own mix. I don't trust the radio. Oh, for copyright bullshit or whatever? Yep. I tried doing radio for the first few times, and yeah, it was just copyright music after copyright music. Fair enough. It took me forever to upload my second stream of my Road to 99. Yeah, I can see that. Because there was like 30 different songs that I had to overwrite. It's just dumb. I might have to do that. Then again, I don't really stream RuneScape too often, and I know nobody on my YouTube channel actually gives a rat's ass. 
So, I forgot to turn that off. It's about the failure, new catch race in life. You knew it's all about the failure. <laughs> should I put that on my channel banner, which I still haven't fucking made? Really should. Oh. Needed two more of these. Boop, boop. But yeah, congrats. I finally talked to Mara about making my characters. <laughs> and she's agreed to try to make the characters. Awesome. Yep. One step closer. And once the characters are made, I'll get her to make a couple of emotes. Yeah, because I can't do characters, so... Definitely don't got the skills for that. Ooh, he actually Shoddy, died. what should my sub emote, my sub badges be? I was thinking a beer, but... Oh, oh my god! I'll go for Holy that. fuck! Dude! Dude! Look at my screen. Have you seen this? And you're not already on Twitch TV. Holy shit. Dude. I'm looking. I'm Dude, a Dude, you got the fucking I'm bet. a fucking legend. <laughs> <laughs> Love it. That is amazing. I I had I demand a clip of that bitch. Holy shit. That is incredible. You know what? I'll make the fucking clip for you. 318 kill count. You know, the, the funny thing is, a lot of people have killed this this, this dude like 4,000 times still haven't gotten him. Like the people who actually want to hunt this stuff, you know? Dude, that is amazing. That is absolutely incredible. Uh, Shoddy, Funky, you don't, you don't know this, but this is, uh... This is one of the pets in the game. Basically, pretty much every boss can drop a pet, and they have various um, drop rates. I mean, Vorkath isn't the rarest, but it, it is 1 in 3,000, so it, it's definitely not the uh, most common. Oh my god, dude, that is amazing. That is absolutely amazing. And to think it even happened on stream, dude. Holy shit. At, fir at first, I was completely shocked. Like, what the hell is that blue thing following me? <laughs> I was like, what, what, what's that blue thing following me? And I was like, dude! That is amazing. Uh, I mean, you bet your ass I'm going to insure him real quick. I think it's like a million to insure a pet. Yep. I think it's an... I'm pretty sure it's an Artie. Arty. That is incredible. Hey. No idea where you can turn. I just know it's like a mill. I think it's in Taverly, actually. Taverly? Yeah, I think it's in Taverly. Oh, this jackass doesn't even have already on here. Um, oh, West Star Doing? That'll work. Oh my god, dude. Yes. That is incredible. Hey. Dude, I'm happy for you. I hope someday I get any kind of pets because I've I, never gotten a pet. Uh, I mean, I mean, regardless, I was gonna end up killing Vorkath probably at least a thousand times. Just, I mean, the the money's just that good, you know? Right. Um, but this this is amazing. Uh, I, I mean, I almost I almost feel bad for the people who ha almost have to tear their hair out for this. You know what I mean? Because, like I said, there are crazy guys who are obsessed with getting like every single pet in the game. You know, like Calphite, you know, the Giant Mole, the mm. Dagonoths. Like I said, I know this isn't the rare one, but it's definitely not the most common one. I and Jesus love some and not all. You are so correct, uh, uh, Shadi. Okay, let me... Edmund, let me talk to you, sir. Hey, old man. Okay, yeah, it says... Insurance fee is 500k. Bet your ass I'm gonna get that. I'm, I'm glad I have it in my bank. Hell, I, nice, I've, def I've definitely made that much tonight. What does this say? I mean, according to this, two and a half mil. I mean, that's not that accurate. It's probably about two mil from supplies, you know. That is incredible, though. 
I'm sure I'm sure you'll get get at least one or two pets once you once you get into it. I Wow. And he was even on stream. Wow. I told you you need to stream more. Uh, you'll get more moments like this on stream. That's that's incredible. <laughs> I'm still somewhat in shock here. Go ahead and... Honestly, you should highlight it on your stream. Well, you mean I, I should put like uh, put it on my trailer or something? Yeah. That's, that's a pretty good idea, actually. I just... Uh, I gotta recheck real quick. I mean, I, I probably won't have him on... You know, I won't have him out too often, but yeah, he is insured. Okay, cool. Wow. Wow. RNG Jesus loves some, but all, no, but not all. Yeah. I know I know. Dragon said that, but I wanted to read it myself. Pure happiness in my voice. Yeah, it's weird happiness because I don't... I'm not really a pet collector. I think it's just the shock of getting something rare like that. I mean, I'd be, like, ten times more freaking out if I got, like, a twisted bow drop, you know what I mean? Uh, I don't know, where do I want to put him? Yeah, that I is... I want to go for a smoke, quick smoke. No longer going to smoke in the house as it made my chest tight yesterday, and I thought it maybe it got virus a second time. Dude. Damn, that would fucking suck, dude. That would suck. Uh, so anyways, uh, back, back to the... You know, drop wise, I should probably just call it quits for tonight. But now I'll do. I'll go another half hour, get more money. You know me. <laughs> Back to the grind, pretty much. Nah, right. we got the drop. We gonna keep going. Yeah, we're gonna keep Maybe going a bit. bit. Another. Um. I mean, in, in theory, yeah, you can get more than one of the same exact pet, but. I don't yeah, know I was who talking would. About another, um, oh you know, yeah, another unique. General. I gotcha. Uh, like I said, a skeletal um, visage would be nice. You know, sixteen mil right there. Never stop, never stopping. Damn right, Shotty. Hell yeah, man. How do you think I got through Dark Souls three, man? I mean, yeah, you, you yeah, I did kind of cheap out. You could say I did summon a couple NPCs to help me, but. I don't really give a fuck, bitch. Fucking noob. I don't give a fuck, bitch. Fucking noob. I do what I want. I do what I want. Fucking noob. I do what I want. <laughs> I do what I want. I get. I got Vorky. I did what I want. So there. I bashed my head against gargoyles for what an hour until I got them down. I mean, if I had to have another pet, um, I think a gargoyle pet would be kind of neat. Well, I mean, you can only get that from the grotesque guardians, right? Mm-hmm. That is fucking amazing. I think I hear Mega Man music now. Fucking hyped. <clears throat> you know how I said it's tough in these streets? You know, last time we, we were streaming together? You know how I said that? Right. I'd say it's pretty good in these streets now, since I got a little dragon to help me out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm such a fuck. <laughs> yeah, that is that is insane. Now you need to get yourself an abyssal orphan. Uh, well, I mean, I can't even kill Abbey Demons yet, so. That's because you ain't slaying, bitch. No, I'm not. I mean, I'm I'm slaying, just not what my master wants me to kill. Because technically I have aberrant specters, <laughs> but fuck them bitches. Out of all the pets, the only one that I really want is the hell puppy. And I think you get out of uh, Cerberus. Um, I think there's a... Uh, there's one I, I, I think is kind of adorable. What is it? I mean, I think the baby mole is pretty adorable. I've heard that's not really that hard to get, though. What is it, like 1 in 500? Mm-hmm. 
You know, that's not that's not that bad. Uh Baby Mole is one in three thousand. Oh. Damn, really? Huh. Yeah. Okay, uh, okay maybe the lowest yeah. one is Maybe not bother with that then. You can exchange an infernal cape for one, so if you kill infernal twice, you can have it and have a cape. Fuck that. <laughs> the Fuck that. Blood is one in sixty six fifty. Chambers of Zarek is one in fifty. Uh da, da, da. Skotos is one in sixty five. Jad is one in one hundred. The rest of them are one in like three thousand. Yeah, Vorky's one in three thousand, bro. You got that what in three hundred and something? Yeah. That's ridiculous. Yeah. That's that's ridiculous. Yeah. Very glad I streamed this tonight. We got that reaction forever in that clip. Yup. Oh. My mind's still trying to accept it. Yeah, that little guy is going to travel me whenever I'm scaling. Giant Squirrel is from Agility. This is probably one I would want to get. Oh, the, the scale pets? Yeah. I have a couple on RS3. I mean, I, I think technically they're easier to get, but they, they are still rare pets, don't get me wrong. Um, I know I have the gargoyle one, and I think I have the farming one. I don't remember. I just know I have the gargoyle one, because it's named after Goyle, like that one of the guys from Harry Potter. You know, mouth always like peons. Right. Get it? You know, crab and Goyle. You know? Yep. Yeah. I guess I they thought you. they were clever. Should not have done that. Getting too antsy now. Dude. Yeah, now I'm starting to suck, but you know what? I'm fine with that. It's fine to suck a bit after you just got something so good. <laughs> <laughs> that could be very sexual. Out of context. Yes. Yes, it could. Yeah, it could. Are you perverted enough to, to make it sexual, Dragon? I could absolutely do that. But then what would your viewers think of me? Who cares what they think? They're not sub to you, so fuck them. <laughs> That's a fair point. True. Nope. Open that. Damn, that not. is fucking awesome, though. All right, uh, enough enough bragging. Shut up, FML. <laughs> <laughs> like I said, if I got a twisted bow, I'd probably be screaming. I mean, just just in the aspect of, oh my god, there's, you know, I don't have to grind my ass off just to get, you know, eighty construction or whatever. Well, I mean, I wouldn't say I have to do that regardless. I mean, I told you I have like. 5 mil cash stack right now. Right. And and I, and I looked it up. It, it said like 18... I think it said about like eight, 16 or 18 mil to get to 84 or something like that. Which, I'll do it incrementally. I don't know why I did that. Whatever, I already killed him two times this trip anyway. Okay, I want to do biohazard now. Doesn't seem that I need anything except for teleports. Come on, okay. you fucker. Uh. Let me 
Yeah, when I was talking to Maro about um, getting the, the 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 your emotes. No, the characters created. Oh yeah. She got really excited when I was talking about the dragon. <laughs> like explaining how I want the dragon done. Yeah. She actually got excited in how I was describing that. Well, hell yeah. So I was like, yeah, that probably gonna turn out really damn good. Yeah, I mean, if the artist is actually passionate about it, yeah. I'm getting her to create two characters for my uh, channel. Um, they're both gonna be used in my emotes. There we go, kill him. Good. Oh, I just got dragon plate legs. Whoop de doo. Yeah, I'm getting her to create a uh, pet dragon. It's like um, cross between a dragon and a cat. Like, it has the mannerisms of a cat, but it's a bit like a baby dragon. The fuck? Yep. So, so it's like a... It's like, a it's like a hybrid anthropomorphic character, then? Mm, think of Happy in his dragon form. Uh, Happy from... Fairy Tale? Yeah, Fairy Tale. A little cat thing that flies around. Yeah, he has a dragon uh, form too. Well, I I guess I didn't get that part. Get that far. I don't remember that. Wow. So Happy is actually a dragon that can transform. Okay. Spoils alert. Yeah. Yeah, I don't care. <laughs> Obviously, because you never got that far. Nope. Why are you not letting me over, bro? You know, just because you like an anime doesn't mean I give a fuck about it. Oh, uh, I need to wear the mask. There you go. Because I'm a scrub. Happy Gilmore? No, not Happy Gilmore. Oh, yeah, totally Happy Gilmore, man. You you remember that scene where Adam Sandler had, like, a little flying dragon friend? That was the best scene in the movie. Aside from when he got his uh golden vest, you know? No, we're talking about Happy from Fairy Tale. It's a little blue cat that can transform into things. And when you look at when you uh, watch the origin story for him, um, you find out that he was originally a dragon that was hatched. Interesting. Most tragic anime stories. I mean, isn't he kind of like the comic relief in the show? Yep. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah, I don't know, for some reason I just... Uh, I couldn't make it past episode, I want to say 60 or whatever. I know I had to deal with um, uh, Nirvana. Like, I think it was the name of some kind of spell. And it, like, warped the personalities of people. That's the farthest I remember getting. Or, like, it, like, flipped their personalities. I don't know. It, it's weird. I never thought it was a bad show, though. I should recharge my prayer. Let's do that. We're right here at the altar. I mean, I could use a good anime to watch. I haven't really seen any that piqued my interest lately, so I haven't been watching any anime. I mean, Mara said, uh... Apparently they're finally doing Attack on Titan the final season. So, about fucking time. The final season? Well, she said the fourth season, but I think it's meant to be the final one. Nah, it's... The, no? The manga's still going. Oh. Okay, never mind then. <laughs> I don't know. Also. You know, the funny thing is, um... Apparently everyone's fall, fallen in love with uh, Demon Slayer. Which, I mean, I have too. I even read the comic. Um, I've it, only read the manga for that. It's hell. I think the comic's pretty good, anyways. But I do quite like the show as well. Um, I actually just started seeing ads for 
for like the movie, like on on YouTube. Like it's talking about the movie being in English, and I'm like, okay, that's unusual. That's pretty awesome, actually. Yeah, I mean, it, I assume it, it. The movie did so fucking well that they felt the need to advertise it on YouTube, which is great. Um, in fact, I think some people said it's the it, it was the best um, grossing movie since Spirited Away. I don't know about that though. And then again, that movie's like 20 years old now. Mm. Comes out this month. Comes out this month. Maybe that's why I'm seeing ads of it on YouTube then. Yeah. I, I mean, I, I mean, I'll watch it anyway. I don't give a fuck. Even though I know the whole story, I don't give a fuck. Do what I want. I actually thought about maybe trying to make a character of a. Uh, of Tanjiro. Like, just, you know, something to do in my spare time. Just to see if I can actually do characters. My, my problem is, I have a very hard time uh, making human-like characters. You know what I mean? Although not every caricature is human-like, but more often than not, they have human-like qualities. You know what I mean? Like, they're anthro. Right. Which is why a lot of my stuff is like cartoon based. I just, I don't know, I, it just, it just, it's, it just ends up, ends up looking weird. Like that grub I did for Mario, I still think he looks a little odd, but, I mean, as long as she's satisfied with it, then, you know. I don't even think I've seen that. It's her channel point, um, uh, image. Oh. Is that what that's supposed to be? It's supposed to be the grubs from Hollow Knight, yeah. Got it. <laughs> yeah. I didn't know what it was or what it could be, so I had no freaking clue. I was just like, uh... You're just like, what? uh, that's a thing. Yeah. <laughs> but now that I know it's Hollow Knight, I know exactly what it is now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Dragon. I had no reference point for it. I mean, you don't play Metroidvania, so... Nope, not really. Yeah, and I'm 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 pretty picky. I'm I'm pretty pick me picky with my Metroidvanias, which people give me shit on, but I don't care. The map is fine. You're just bitching, Ryan. Oh shit! I just name dropped myself. Oh well. Whatever. Who cares? Everybody knows your name anyway. All they do if they're subscribed to my new t channel. I really need to make another episode. Don't you have another Japan game uh, Twitter account besides Japan games? No, that's the only Twitter I've ever had. Really? Yes, really. Why do you think I've got so many followers so quickly, bro? Because you cheat? No. I advertise on Twitter. I don't think that's as good as what you think it is. Mm, not unless my not, follows are straight from Twitter. Yeah, well, not unless your following on Twitter is already well well established. Like I think I have twelve followers on Twitter. But I am way more active than you on Twitter. Probably no. Hold on. Hold on. I know both of us are more active than Funky. Yeah, we are. <laughs> yeah, I I think Funky that's never says anything on Twitter. Yeah. Um, I can can I can I teleport with these? I want to try to teleport with these. Why does this song sound familiar? Is this Chrono Cross? I wish I could look, but I'm busy. No, you cannot teleport with these. They will break. That's because I'm antisocial. Well, stop being an antisocial bitch. Yeah, stop being a bitch. <laughs> Hurry up and kill him, you stupid fuck. Got some Celeste playing on my channel right now. Mmm. Okay. Hip hip hooray. <laughs> <sighs> uh, 
we were I was supposed to uh, set up that fucking bot the next time we did something like this. But this was kind of impromptu. Very much so. Yep. And it's because of the pole. Only because of the pole. There's some good stuff in that pole. You love too. them. You love love working on them poles, huh? You damn right. Mm. Giggity. <laughs> <laughs> All right, gave that file to you. All right, cool. Uh, actually, we might have enough for. Ooh, more battle staffs? Hell yeah, dude. You know what, fuck it, I think I'm gonna try to kill him one more time. I do have Manta Rays, after all. Risking that biscuit. I mean, I can always GTFO. Ooh, I got a Magic Seed, I I, I didn't even realize. Yeah, the Demon, Demon Slayer movie broke the records of Spirited Away, yes. Yeah. I said hell, hell yeah. I, I saw, I remember seeing on, um... I, I think it was... I think it was responses to like Crunchyroll or whatever, because I think they were one of the first to actually like air the you know the anime. Uh, there are people getting pissed off because the creator hardly got any kind of uh, you know money out of its success. And there's actually someone who commented that's kind of the way the industry works in Japan. It doesn't matter how popular it is or well established yep. the creator is, you basically get peanuts, and that's just the way it is. Yep. And I think that's horseshit. You may pass. Thank you, sir. Almost done with biohazard. I almost thought about doing a taste of hope tonight, but I'll probably do that tomorrow morning. Uh, I'm actually... Yeah, after Darkness of Hollowville, I was actually kind of intrigued by the uh, the story, you know what I mean? Like, killing the vampires and all that shit. Like, that sounds cool. So, I'm kind of more inclined to do A Taste of Hope. Because I know you actually kill, like, kind of a, a badass vampire in that quest. A Taste of Hope? Yeah. It's the one right before Sins of the Father. I mean, you do fight something, but it's not as badass as you might think. Huh. Like, it, you're strong enough to where it won't be that hard. I mean, Frame Nick's Ex Exiles quest wasn't too tough, but it wasn't easy. Yeah, Frame Nick's Exile isn't that hard. It is interesting, though. Yeah, I thought it was fun. You know, quests are supposed to be fun. You know, a lot. You know, a lot of a lot of RSers don't think so, but no, nope, no, nope. it has to be balls hard, so nobody can complete it. Yeah. Until Luke's figures out some strategy that yeah. even a dumb moron can do. Like me. <laughs> <laughs> Man, do I really want to grab all this shit? I I don't want to grab all these blue dragon heights. Fuck that. Boom. Oh well, I'm Turn gonna I'm to I'm gonna leave seven k of loot here. I'm such a bad guy. Oh my god. The worst. I'm the worst person ever. Let's see what time is it? Hundred, hundred fifty eight minutes or an hour fifty eight minutes. <laughs> I'll I'll do one more trip here, and then edit off for tonight. I mean, I got. I don't think this will actually. Yeah, my loot tab won't show it, because it, it'll cut it off, but according to this, uh, 3.7 mil right now. Not bad. Again, I know that's off, but sure sounds good. Well, I did get some good shit. Onyx bolts, Onyx bolt tips, Dragon Longsword, Renar Seed, Magic Seed. Fucking dope sauce, man. Oh no. I'm almost at anti venom. Oops. I can probably squeeze enough just for one more trip. I might only have to kill two, though. Grab 
that. You wanna grab that. Grab that super store. Hey, the plague is not a plague. There's nothing there. Woo! The plague is a lie? No way. No way. The plague is a lie. I don't fucking believe you. That's what the dude said. Plague is a lie. There's nothing there. So, Funky, what are you doing right now? You still... Uh, you're still not grinding for that tactics challenge, are you? I'm somewhat curious about that. Like, if there's going to be some... Some failure involved. Some, you know... Some rage moments. Because that's what I'm about. About that Funky rage. over there fapping in the corner to some Tifa art. He probably is. He probably is. Nah, he's, tactics is ready to go already. He's got his he's got his uh, Tifa body pillow with him too. Right. Yeah. I've got my Bowser one in the corner. You know, she's she's just chilling. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. You probably have a furry one in the corner. No, I'm probably not a furry. You probably have like a Lola bunny body pillow with you. Okay, if it was Lola, I'd make an exception for I was Lola. about to say, you know. <laughs> <laughs> they knew what they were doing when they made her character. you damn right. Oh my lord. Yup. Alright, hopefully and I can... That is Biohazard done. Hopefully I can do two kills here. I'm ready! <sighs> I can't even start this quest. Yeah, it's underground passage. What do I need for underground passage? I got level 10 thieving. Mm -hmm. Okay. Underground passage, I need 30 thieving. Yeah, I don't have that. Hell yeah, man. Kicking ass, taking names. Hey, Funky, were you there when I got my, uh, my rare-ass pet, by the way? Dragon clipped it. It's pretty badass. Ooh, I almost got killed there, but I didn't. Got to turn that off, dummy. I think we're gonna do Demon Slayer next. I need some bones. I need. I need stuff. I just need stuff. I uh, just for just for grins at work. Um, you know, as you know, I I tend to have a fair amount of downtime there. Uh, I actually started to make a. Like a Hall of Night wallpaper and illustrator, just because I was bored. So maybe that'll look kind of cool. I have not been keeping quest items in the right tab. You're doing some work for your actual job? Oh, you were here? Okay. Work for your actual job? Uh, in the middle of the night. Yeah, like why? <laughs> Are you doing homework? Are you doing research on something for a meeting coming up? Or then again, it's none of my business. You can just tell me the, you know, st, stfu. Did you really have to think about that? Yes, that I hard? did. Want to fight about it? Nah, you do you. Okay, good. Because you probably kick my ass. Because I know you've been working out. I mean, there wasn't a question about me kicking your ass from the beginning, so I don't know what your point is. Them's fighting words, man. <laughs> just because just you're older, you think you can pick on people less than 30? You probably do. Fuck it. I, I should pick on teenagers. I know shit because you've been slacking, you fucking slacker. Uh, Varrock teleport and 
passage. I don't have a passage. Shoot. Dude. Boom. This song sounds super familiar. Three of these. Boom. What is this song from? Got four of them. Whatever. Sounds like it's oh, this sounds like it's from like um, Stronghold Crusader game or something, some kind of RTS game. Hey, at least I'm self-aware slacker who acknowledges when I fuck up and don't hide behind excuses. Exactly. That is a better slacker than most. But you're still a fucking slacker. Yeah. A fucking slacker. Yeah. <laughs> You've just been had. Okay, I need to know what song this is. What is song is this? Oh, this is from fucking Halo Reach. Fuck that game. Slacker pride, bitch. Halo fucking sucks. All right. I I remember when um. Well, I mean, it wasn't that long ago, but I remember when like they they put like Halo on on Steam, and everyone was losing their fucking tits over it. And I'm like, uh, people actually go back for this shit. Like what the fuck? I just I I, I never got why people still give a still still give Halo the time of game nowadays. I can see back in like you know two thousand like one to like uh when the three hundred and sixty came out because that was pretty much the only thing that defined Microsoft then. I mean, didn't Halo Bundle come to PC recently? Yeah. Like, all of them? Yeah. I, I, I was saying, like, everyone was, like, losing their fucking shit over it coming, like, like, to Steam. And I was thinking, why are people still on about this Halo stuff? If it's just nostalgic to you, yeah, that's, that's fine. But, the, you know, there's stuff that's still nostalgic to me, but I realized how shit it was. Uh, for example, the uh, movie Son of the Mask. That movie fucking sucks. Uh, I mean, do I think it's a 3 out of 10 like it shows on IMDb? No, but it's not a good movie. So it's a 4 out of 10. Uh, honestly, I'd probably have to rewatch it to let you know. I'm going to get hit here. I fucked up. Oh, so it's an FML out of 10. Got it. There's no scale for FML, by the way. <laughs> I don't know if Funky didn't tell you this. You know, he likes to hide things from us. Like, I, st I still haven't found his OnlyFans account, but I'm looking. I know he's got one. It exists. It exists. He hasn't told me what it is, either. I bet Morrow knows. Morrow totally knows. Morrow's probably his biggest tipper. And then next to Walker, how, how do you think Walker learned about the helicopter penis? Right? Think about it. Think about it. I'm no rube. Alright. Let's kill the knight here. Uh, no. I didn't mean to do that. Dummy. There we go. I mean, I got a shit ton of experience for that. More dragon dart tips. Now my the most fun thing to do is try to sell all this shit and see that cash stack. I love that. Mara's the only one who knows. What? I still don't believe that. Halo one and two are still great. First-person shooter campaigns, especially co-op. Wait, uh, Halo 1 and 2 are co-op? Uh, I was pretty sure the second one was. I, I thought the first one was like just a strict one-player experience, though. If they're co-op, I would not mind playing those with somebody that's never played them before themselves. Uh, I haven't played Halo. Well, the thing is, I am really hesitant to spend any money on a Halo game, so probably wouldn't be me, Dragon. 
I mean, if it's a bundle. Yeah, it's just. I mean, I, I fucking suck at shooters anyway. Why'd I do that? I did that out of habit. I wanted to go to the GE here to sell my shit. Master you helping you curate comment before you share it all. Damn. Mara's the only one who knows. <laughs> yeah, I bet. I bet she'll curate it. Although, I, I would assume her standards are not too high. I mean, what's she going to do? Is she going to be like, oh, you got to redo that take. You know, your your, piece, your penis wasn't out far enough. You know? Damn. <laughs> we are a bunch of debaucherous perverts. And that's what makes the internet work so well with us, right? Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, now the best so the part. Master Chief's collection has all the Halos, and you can play online. Um, yeah, I I seriously I, would I, not I still mind playing that with someone else that has never played them before. I know that wouldn't be funky, because I know he played it back in the day. It's not gonna be me because I don't I don't give a rat's ass if it's a collection or not. Uh. Hell, hell, I, hell, I, I, I'd rather play Serious Sam than Halo. I've never played Serious Sam either. That's actually on my to-do list. Maybe we could co-op that. I have it on Steam. I don't have them. <laughs> Maybe I'll gift them to you at some point. They're not, they're not insanely in in expensive. I know that. When they're on sale again, I'll take a look at them. All right. Oh, look at all this good shit. The most Funky. satisfying. Is it two-player co-op or is it multiplayer co-op? I mean, I know they have like, you know, versus deathmatch. Like that's another thing Halo is kind of famous for. Let's try to sell a lot of this shit here. Some of this stuff I'll probably just leave in the bank overnight, or the GE. Sell that magic seed, 172k. It, it blows my mind how rich these fuckers are to, to you know, sell all this, um, or to buy all these magic seeds and stuff. I'm specifically talking about the campaign. Is the campaign co-op, and can you have more than two people? So those magic logs. Uh -oh. So those dragon bones. So the loop half. Oh, that's why I need the necklace of passage. Got it. Sell that, sell that. Sell the wrath rounds. All right. Like, I would want to do a co op campaign. If that doesn't exist, then I don't care one way or the other. You played all of those, but you did buy the collection? Halo 1 and 2 is only up to two players on the campaign. Other Halos are up to four people. Mm -hmm. Okay. I mean, you know, it you know, it is what it is. It's just it's just one of those things I don't understand. I got the bones, bro. Okay, let's go ahead and high elk some of this shit here real quick. Here's bones. Dragon plate skirt. High elk that. Dragon plate legs. High elk that. Okay. And a bunch of these rune long swords. Kill Dareth. I could have sworn I got some. No, I, I guess I didn't get any kite shields. Okay. You can go to champ skill to get there faster. All right, Funky. You know that's bringing me to uh, have this idea <laughs> because it's four-player co-op campaign. Oh Jesus Christ! <laughs> that's insanity. <laughs> that is insanity. What? It'd be awesome, man. Well, well, I mean, let, let's it, let's live in let's live in Funky's reality. 
his schedule is full of what ifs and maybes. So true. Like, I don't know when the fuck Very we're true. gonna do our race. I don't know when the fuck we're gonna play Gunstar Heroes. I don't know when the fuck we're going to um do the Castle Crashers thing. You know what I mean? Like it, it's 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 in the ether. Like I I can't pull it out of the void. It's stuck in there. So, <laughs> like I can push things way easier than Funky can push uh, his shit in terms of his streaming schedule. Now, who else will be interested in playing Halo? I have no idea. But I'm totally up for Castle Crashers. Castle Crashers is definitely on the docket. Yeah, for show. Because it's, it's a fun game, and I like fun I even games. Bought that shit a couple of years ago. Oh shit! I forgot I had Dragon Long Swords. Hell yeah, dude! I'd have hacked those bitches. FML, what days do you work? Uh, every day but Sunday and Monday usually. Hmm. Although, well, I mean, it, I, I'd say it's pretty safe to say uh, I i have every Monday and Sunday off. The reason I put maybe on there is because, like, sometimes I would switch shifts with my boss because, like, her son would uh, be playing football, but the, po the football season's done, so that's not a factor anymore. So, high school football. I'm sure you knew what I meant. I didn't know it was high school, but football is football. Yeah, football's still shit. <laughs> Watch your mouth, boy. But you like football? Dude, I played football for eight years. Well, you waste your fucking life. <laughs> mm, yeah, and that's why I'm strong enough to beat your ass. Well, that's not still not going to change my mind about football. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Go be chubby, all right? I mean, my fat is wiggling right now in, in agreement, so... <laughs> Oh, I'm so sad and pathetic. <laughs> Man, I might as well just lower this 5%. I still have made bank today anyways. Although normally I, normally I leave this stuff in overnight. Like, like the big stuff, like admin ore, I don't give a fuck. I'll go 5% less. But like, don't give a fuck. But like the dragon darts, the superior bones, I, I like to try to extort as much as I can. I'm an extortionist. What do I gotta do? What? You can change some, some shit around to be, to be fair. Sunday is probably the best day for any of these co-op things for me. This is true. It's it's oh, it's not for Dragon though. Yeah, I can't do Sundays at all. Yeah. Not right now. So if I get this new job where Trip I'm working Monday to Friday, there we go. Then we can start talking about doing Sunday shit. Okay, so can you do job already? I'm trying, bro. I'm fucking trying. Oh, I thought you were talking to me. <laughs> I mean, I need a new job also. So, um, I don't think you understand how hard I've been trying. Uh, I don't know how hard have you, how, how hard have you been trying, sir? I mean, it's a solid rock. So, how hard do you think? Harder than diamond? Eh, depends on the diamond, cause some diamonds can be soft, you know. But yeah, pretty close. Okay, I actually have 27 battle staffs that I got. I'm not going to sell those, though. I'm going to turn them into staffs and then high alk them, because I'm a noob. But that's about 200k more onto my cash deck. So according to this, uh, 3.4 mil. Yeah. Underground Pass should not be on here. Why? What? 3.4 mil and a pet, which is pretty dope. Where, where'd I put him? Oh, that says recommended. There it is, there it is, there it is. Oh. 
Dude, this pet is so freaking awesome. What do you think of my pet, Funky? He's got three legs. Does your pet have three legs? I didn't fucking think so. <laughs> now, now, now the funny thing is, like, this is going to make people think I have, like, a couple thousand kills of Warcath, which is hilarious. I don't have a fit, so you can fuck off. Funky, you don't even play, so fuck off. <laughs> What's the next quest that I should do? Fight Arena? Mm. Someone responded with his kill count, 28. Well, you know what? He fucking sucks. He probably doesn't even have his uh, accumulator yet, or assembler. You don't have a pet, so I can fuck off. Fuck, he just jelly. He just jelly. I can tell. Sunday will be better for tomorrow, too. Okay. Uh, yeah, I think, I, th quest. I, think, uh, I think that'll be all for this uh, stream for me. I'm going to... I'm going to pick up my Vorky. I know I can talk to him, but I'll do that later. Yeah, I'm going to end the stream and probably get a little bit of money in Hollow Knight and then go to sleep. So, Thanks for uh, thanks for the follow. Again, um, Joe, I appreciate it. Uh, Joe the bro. Joe the bro. And thanks for uh, thanks for watching, guys. Yeah, it took me a second to even think of that. I'll <laughs> see you guys uh, tomorrow for a little bit of craziness in Rocket League. So, bye.